same thing as we show, uh, so we'll use it. What are they making at present? Sometimes we cannot actually do lots of things at present, but we have to make a plan, like uh, what are our future plans should be. Uh, according to that, we have to make a concept in our mind, what we have to do. We, uh, we, would, we self discuss to ourselves or with some other people. So we, we have uh, lots of the ideas in our minds and uh, we just start doing uh, work for that. Uh, according to that, we are the keep best result in our future. Okay? Uh, now uh, my first topic is over. Okay. Let's uh, one by one topic will continue. Then it will be interesting. And uh, then we come up with the second topic. So oh. firstly we will continue with the first. Then uh, then it will be interesting. So so we have three topic. As you saw, so you so shall you read. So it means that every action have some reaction. And uh, whatever you have done something, it will impact in your life. So this is our topic. So if anybody want to talk in this topic, please unmute yourself and talk about this topic. And we have another topic also, how much- Abhishek, Abhishek, can you hear? Hi Abhishek, can you hear us? Abhishek, who has left? Okay, no problem. Uh, anger. Anger MD, can you hear? Puja, can you hear us? Hmm. Anger Abhishek Puja, out of you, is there anyone hearing us? Please unmute, unmute your mic. Okay, Ranjana, Hello. then you. Oh, yes, Puja. Yes, I am hearing you. Okay, you can start now. First topic. Uh, there are three topics. Out of this, any one you can choose. Any two you can choose. I want to talk about the last topic, sleep late night. Okay, yes, start. So, sleeping in a uh, night uh, at hours is important. If we sleep at hours, we feel good. We, if we sleep at hours, we build up confidence. Uh, uh, our ma mental health uh, work in a good way, effective way. Uh, sleep prevent us from diabetes, uh, diabetes, and sleep boost our mental health well-being. And uh, if we sleep uh, two, three hours, four hours, then will be disadvantage. There are many disadvantages. We feel every time tired, uh, irritable, uh, irritated and the difficulty to concentrate our studies, our work. Uh, we can't make a decision. Uh, we, are, uh, we feel depression. Our mind is overthinking all the time. If we um, sleep uh, at hours daily, we feel confident to our brains work uh, in a good way. So that's our, uh, my views about the sleeping. Thank you very much. You really spoke very well. Now uh, moving on to next next uh, participant. I have question with, yes, yes. Me, I have question with the Pooja. Uh, uh, Pooja, please uh, suggest the best timing. Uh, which timing is best for the sleep? Have you any idea? Yes. Then told I want to speak about my next topic. Second, topic, marks and grade do not reflect the student. Can I? I yeah. Think, yeah. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Nine p.m. is good time to sleep. <laughs> okay. Can I say something about this, this topic? Shall I start? Yes. Yes. You can. Great, do not directly reflect intelligence. Great, must matter, mastery, which is a combination of a variety of elements. Focus, 
ہے اسٹوڈنٹ پلیسز آن ماسٹری پرسنل ڈرائیو دیر آر لوٹس آف اے گڈ پیپل آف ایوریج انٹیلیجنٹ ہو آر ایبل ٹو ارن ہائی گریڈ سمپلی بیکاز دیر آر کنسلٹنٹلی اینڈ ڈو دا ہارڈ ورک وائل دا اپوزٹ از آلسو ٹرو دیر آر لوٹس آف ہائیلی انٹیلیجنٹ ٹو ہر ہو فلنگ آؤٹ آف کورسز اور ارن مرجینل گریڈ ان دوس کیسز اٹ کین یوزلی بی ایٹریبیوٹیڈ ٹو آئیدر امیونٹی ان میچورٹی اور لیک آف موٹیویشن اور پرسنل ویژن Okay, really you spoke well. Thank you for your valuable speech. Now, Vikas has also spoken. Sanjeev, uh, Sanjeev, uh, spoken or not? Yes, I have. Okay, okay, okay. Now, uh, Engel has not spoken. Engel, can you hear us? I think there is network problem. Abhishek also has spoken, I think, right? ویری <laughs> in the present moment it will be effect in your life just like uh, your habit is telling the lie to people so it's maybe the might be happened that uh, presently you will enjoy with your uh, lie uh, because you got some advantage from that but later you will got that uh, you uh, you will uh, find something difficulty so i think whatever you do present it will be impact like if you want to become something so if you practice uh, from your childhood then definitely will become something so your past action also reveal your future so uh, so always do the good thing it will be always multiply of that so uh, you know that uh, by in the science that uh, every reaction has the opposite reaction so yeah this topic are uh, very nice i think uh, we have to follow uh, we uh, also we in learn in the gita that uh, um, Kar- karma is always moving around us so uh, believe in yourself and uh, do always positive thing always happen the positive thing in as a result so this thing i want to mention in this topic really good really you have spoken very good thank you now who has left for the first round i think anger anger has not spoken yet please you unmute your mic and try to speak because we all are learner here i think he is not hearing due to network issue so shall i speak something on the first topic yes yes abhishek please yes yes the first topic is uh, uh, Okay, let me check the... Yes, yes, yes. As you sow, so shall you reap. It means we all are responsible, really responsible for the result, for the you know outcome of our action. Right? Because if we do good things in our life, definitely we will, it will produce good outcome. So, the moral of this... you know this is a power power actually it is uh, mentioned in the bible uh, especially holy gita and you know quran also emphasize on this proverb that uh, we should do good thing always then only we will get a good result sometime we might not uh, get the results immediately after doing the work good work but we definitely can wait for long run we will get good things so that's all thank you very much now for the next round i think anger is uh, hearing us hello anger okay no he is not hearing so you know ranjana you okay. can start for uh, okay. from next round okay okay 
uh, once anybody come then we will uh, uh, again come with the first topic so let's move on the second topic without delaying our time so my second topic i chosen because most of people feel that uh, uh, grade actually reflect the student intelligence so actually i want to uh, know about your uh, opinion that's why i taken the this topic uh, let's show, show my screen second topic is uh, marks and grade uh, don't reflect the student intelligence is just a question mark uh, is really uh, marks uh, shows our intelligent or not so according to my perception grade, grade marks and grade not uh, reflect our intelligence because sometime uh, whatever the question came in exam uh, it's totally uh, sometime we are got frustrated sometime we ill sometime we have the family problem so we can't con concentrate our study sometime our marks become very bad so people are thinking that we are very lack in uh, education but uh, actually it's not uh, only marks uh, in check our intelligence just take the example of so many celebrity uh, like uh, Tan, uh, uh, sachin tendulkar who is not uh, good in uh, academic but th that you can say that that person is uh, not intelligent so so many people are uh, have different quality so i think uh, grade and marks not reflect the intelligence yeah we can say that it reflect the intelligence some in some extents suppose that if there are uh, in, uh, in a examination uh, so many people are written that exam and we have to some uh, filter criteria we have to filter then we will uh, uh, become something so if there is a competition so we we are doing this thing is okay but uh, every time we will check uh, go through the that uh, the grade and marks i think that is not a uh, parameter of checking the intelligence of somebody so this thing i want to put <coughs> in this topic okay thank you very much uh, evangela you have spoken very well now uh, uh, angel i think he is hearing us yes yes, yes, yes. i am hearing okay very good evening to you very good evening everybody good evening good evening so which which topic would you like to choose uh, there are three topics uh, now topic is going on marks uh, marks, marks yes. or grade and not yes. reflects students intelligence yes yes i i will tell you something uh, uh, about this topic okay sure okay mm, according to me mm, uh, examination grades are just board indicator of one's performance in that particular examination based on marketing criteria that does not indicate one's intelligence for instance good grades uh, can be obtained by selective studying which will definitely uh, limit the intelligence of students but many may but may ensure that uh, the grade uh, that ga they get good grades in exam grades are being most uh, common way to determine the student intellect they may not always uh, be reliable there are many uh, business owner and uh, scientist uh, who gets in their life in top position but they do not have university degree so we can say we can easily say examination grades are not um, accurate way to determining the uh, one's overall yeah you come uh, very good uh, uh, that's all that's great discussion because thank you thank you anger you really spoken good points yes because which uh, topic you are choosing there are two more topics uh, another topic um, as you so so will you read so shall you read am i right yes 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 it means that the result 
of anything will be in accordance with the, with this action now a farmer shows crown um, he cannot expect carrots uh, if we do uh, good work in proper way we may expect good result childhood um, is the golden period of man's life uh, from childhood on should cultivate good habits uh, they uh, they may shine in life that's all really good really good now uh, yeah vikas you were talking about uh, which one i just talk about the topic okay so yeah you must start hmm hmm you can start no problem uh, often the smartest person in the classroom is not the one with the highest grades uh, he is the least intelligent Bolle. person in the class the one with the lowest grades kon ne topic bole i am not hearing clearly yes vikas i think you are not using your mic properly you just hold your mic in front of your mouth okay now is clear yes now now it is clear yeah. now it is clear get great reflect several things and while high intelligence surely helps a person learn more and low intelligence makes it harder to learn the great a student gets has more to do with things besides intelligence than intelligence what do great reflect what goes into getting high grade in no particular order the ability to understand what the teacher wants the willingness to give the teacher what they want the ability to keep one's self organized and keep track of what is needed to accomplish the academic tasks that and to know when they are मार्क्स एंड ग्रेड या स्लीपिंग बताला बता दे भैया ले
Raja, are you thinking that uh, only the marks and grade uh, only change the intelligence of the student? Only the one. Yes, yes, you are right. Give the another question to the chance.
have the extra uh, uh, knowledge and extra uh, uh, skill set, he can also uh, reflect through his mark sheet and by so that the evaluator, if he go gone into any interview, uh, interviewer can judge from his interview uh, the uh, mark sheet what are the skill sets that he, they have. But the real growth, but the real growth of the students are not just the only marks. Because someone is not studying in the good university or the good college, uh, I, they have not a good uh, results in their curriculum. Uh, it's not reflect that he have not a good knowledge, or uh, he have not a good IQ or EQ. Uh, actually, sometimes uh, when the exams are conducted, uh, that side the student under the pressure or under a behind that under which the student cannot uh, perform very well. Uh, yes, sir, sir, you understand? Uh, yes, you are um, very much audible. And yes, clear. very good, very good, very good. Hello? So I think uh, every one of us has uh, spoken now. Yes, yes. Hello? Uh, yeah, we can hear you. You have spoken really good. Thank you for your, uh, you know, hard effort, your, your valuable time. And uh, I think every one of us has uh, spoken on two topics, isn't it, Ranjana? Yes, yes. Hello. If you want to add something in it, uh, in it. Hello. Yes, you are audible. Hello. Uh, now I am audible. Yes, you are audible. Yes, you are. You are audible. Actually, my network connection got disconnected. Okay. So, okay. Uh, let, let me continue with my topic. Actually, I am okay. saying that uh, they sometimes take a mark sheet or do not actually reflect the student calibrity, EQ or IQ or the skill set. Because uh, during the examination, uh, he got under the some pressure or uh, get some uh, some problem uh, so that he cannot uh, get the good marks in the uh, in his, his schools, their college time. So, so uh, his uh, reflection on the mark sheet is not actually actual the good one. So I think the uh, overall evaluation of the student is judged by himself student. So the, throughout the life we learn more and more things and a lot of the skill set that required by the student itself so that he can perform the very well in the uh, in his future. So according to my view, uh, along with his institutional demand or the marks, together with his himself uh, developed some good qualities and skill set, so that he doesn't introduce himself uh, too much so his marks it only. But he can also represent himself as a what are the calibrity in him uh, to front up him anybody if he present. Okay. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. Good, good, very good. So yes, I must, uh, I must uh, tell something about this. Okay. So as I think uh, every one of Abhishek, we has finished this. Please some point because I think you are not spoken on that topic. Uh, on the topic, I have not spoken yet, but uh, yes, uh, as uh, everybody has covered all the things, then also I am trying to okay. speak something. Okay. okay. So, uh, I hope uh, I am very clear to everyone. Okay. Yeah, we Everyone. Okay. So, see, first of all, the, um, it doesn't, uh, you know, reflect, I do believe, because uh, in mark sheet, uh, you know, marks can be buy can be purchased okay, yeah. that is true you believe or not but i believe it i in my experience i seen somewhere uh, you know some of my friends purchased the marks they paid money while during the examination and they showed in the exam hall okay so marks in his or her mark sheet it doesn't mean that he or she is intelligent because the definition of the intelligent is uh, something another you know, most of the people think intelligent and marks are same. Mm -hmm. He ha has he has scored 90 percent. It means he is or she is very intelligent. Not like that. Intelligent is the definition of the intelligent is the level of the thinking. 
how what level are you your thinking is that is intelligent in which level your mind thinks that is called intelligent it doesn't matter how much marks i have scored in the exam it doesn't matter it matters now present time how i feel how i you know so you know see surround me how i deal with a problem that is called intelligent right I, if i go somewhere i have a graduate degree and if i go somewhere and somebody if there is some problem occurred in that point if i you know take out my mark sheet if i show to show somebody see 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 i have a graduation certificate i have a graduation certificate i am a graduate i am educated i am intelligent but i can solve the problem isn't it people will laugh at me people will laugh at me my dear you are a graduate you are educated you are intelligent but you cannot solve this problem right so it doesn't reflect that is true it can be by but it now, can be by degrees okay, <laughs> but nowadays uh, Uh, marks is also important in some uh, some some yes yes because yes, i am saying i was saying the exam has a merit list so we have to pass that merit list then uh, we are able to crack something so you are right you are right you are totally right to some extent yes yes it is it is valid to some extent without any knowledge without any intelligence no one can score like more than 90% if someone is scoring 90% if there are 100 people who score 90% most of them are really intelligent person some of them are not intelligent yes. some of them few of them might not be intelligent as they scored yes. 90% right and it the more thing is the, the many thing is you know the you know development of a mind it varies person to person some person uh, you know some person mind develop after 20 or 25 some person's mind you know get matured in 12 itself so it depend on the person to person student to student it is not same for everybody so thank you very much guys yeah yeah you add very good point to... <laughs> actually intelligent and great totally different things great can be measured by examination and there is no measuring tools to measure intelligence over the world i think yes yes you are very correct there this is no correct machine. correct point actually actually the if if the students are the learning in the institution the qualitative analysis is good through the marks i think yes, but yes. the quantitative analysis of the student uh, i think Uh, soft skill of the students are not just through the only marks because uh, soft skill are just through the only the practically uh, we can uh, ask by something question so we uh, by uh, taking some judgment so uh, this uh, this is a real skill that uh, is only just for after interviewing him okay okay yeah that's uh, this is very good topic everybody is discuss very uh, smartly in this that uh, grade and both has important but uh, have some extents and we, uh, there is not machine to uh, check the intelligence of somebody but uh, uh, grade is a way we can check the quality yeah we can understand that person is something good but uh, it's not absolute right that by grade we can judge him because even in interview they will uh, check the your uh, degree as well your uh, soft skill your communication skill so many things so uh, nowadays both are important in some extents uh, and uh, yeah uh, sometime i see that many people are the good in the communication they talk very good but the real work which have to they do they are not actually doing the good Oh, so sometimes yes. only the communication is not a good thing. Yes. 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 A yes. lot of the parameters through which we can analyze a person is say, ah, uh, he is actually a competitive competitive person for a company or the or his university uh, uh, is by the many methods. Yes. Sir. so i think we have all spoken so i think uh, we should uh, uh, finish the session I isn't think it last guys last topic is uh, not much uh, discussed how much sleep do you yes, need yes, daily yes yes last topic 
is not much discussed how um, because that the topic we not discuss so we have not much clarity so if someone have some clarity in the topic so how much sleep so, do we need the daily and is uh, sleeping late night is unhealthy yes vandana uh, i want to say something uh, regarding this topic how much sleep do we have actually need uh, actually uh, sleep only uh, uh, memorize our uh, give relax to our mental status or uh, sometimes our the body also uh, firstly we need to understand what is sleep actually uh, sleep uh, why we need a sleep uh, the question uh, the answer for this is the sleep actually uh, make our mind uh, um, better for the work for the next work and uh, it gives a relaxation for the our uh, body also during the sleep we uh, take the so much of the oxygen uh, give or uh, uh, take the oxygen and give uh, outside our body uh, carbon dioxide uh, so the good breathing exercise mind is relaxed calm places then it recover our body along with our mind Uh, make our body refresh. If someone has sleep in the noisy place, uh, not a good place, then he take the so much sleep, but not get a proper deep sleep, real sleep. If someone is drink and then take rest and he sleep more than twelve hours, after that. okay yeah yeah thanks for uh, adding that point yeah actually i also believe that uh, sleeping uh, uh, any proper sleep like 6 to 8 hour i think is uh, enough it's not depend on the timing i believe that because uh, some people are doing night shift some people are uh, shift is varied but uh, if you are taking any time proper sleep uh, 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 sleep like 8 uh, 6 to 7 8 properly without any disturbance so then you whenever you come uh, with your work then you will very feel very uh, refreshed and you will work your work very uh, effectively so i think uh, even if you see the uh, pilots they are uh, have a very uh, different timing but even they have uh, their mind is very uh, sharp by uh, because they have to monitor everything because they are command over the uh, sky so they have to uh, very vigilant so if you taken if they uh, taken the proper sleep they work energetic so i think uh, you you should take the proper uh, sleep whatever you time prefer so you have to take 7 5 to 7 8 whatever comfortable for your body and uh, uh, i think uh, night sleep is uh, sometime unproductivity 
and uh, because sometimes uh, at nights not uh, a good thing because uh, in day time we see everybody is work up everybody is working so we feel more ag- energetic but at night we uh, learn alone then we feel that uh, uh, sometime we wasting our time in night so i think uh, it's very according to uh, person to person okay yes yes sir sure. stamina oh, yes yes sir Yes, 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 yes. 